Okay. Okay. Uh, welcome uh, to the special uh, edition of my Anuga in, uh, with Dad Alumni Seminar Interview Series. We have special guests uh, from Dominican Republic. Welcome, Saida. Uh, can you introduce yourself to my audience? Yeah, sure. Hi, my name is Saida Vasquez. I'm from Dominican Republic. I'm a food technology engineer. Uh, that's uh, what I study in my bachelor. And I did uh, my master's degree here in Germany two years ago. Where? It was in Stuttgart, okay. in the University of Hohenheim. Okay. And my master was in environmental protection and food agricultural production. That's is my background. Yeah, the, the German guy is speaking louder, so you have to speak a little bit Okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> fine. Yeah. So at the moment, I work at the ESA University. I'm a lecturer and research ESA advisor. Means what? Institute of uh, Superior Agriculture. Yeah, so I teach uh, food science for the food technology engineer uh, students, and I also teach uh, food microbiology and research methodology at the moment. So, also, yeah. I, I also uh, learned that you have a lot of international experience. Can you elaborate on your German and other Asian uh, experience? Yeah. Okay. So, well, uh, by the time I did my master's degree here in Germany, I also got a chance to travel to Thailand to do my master's thesis degree. So I spent there three months in the Silpakon University, it's called. It's near Bangkok, in Nakopakon. I don't know if I, if I said it okay. So how, how is your experience in Thailand? Uh, I think it should be your first uh, experience in Asia. Did yeah, and the first and I think the only one. Oh, okay. But it was really nice. Besides all the academic knowledge I gained from from the Thailand yeah. people, I learned a lot about the culture because they are very welcoming people, very nice people. Okay. So I feel all the time like I was at home. They are very respectful. But they are very Buddhist. Buddhist. Yeah, they are Buddhist. You have so, any Buddhist connection? Yeah, my, my father is Buddhist, <laughs> by the way. So for me, it was a really new experience because in, in, in all the contexts, the religion, the people, the food was the most shocking one for me because of the spicy foods. But I really taste, uh, I like it to taste different kind of uh, feelings when you taste food. And it was really interesting. Very, a lot, they mix a lot of sugar and salty bread and so it was, So we have, a, so we have our guests. Yeah, our guests here. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, top, uh, Chico, 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 Chico. Chico. Chico has been part of our program. He's very handsome. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, it's Spanish. Okay. So, yeah. yeah. So. Yeah. Now, uh, so I want to ask, like, uh, like your German, like winter. Uh, this is not really winter, but it's a uh, dark international alumni <laughs> seminar. So, what is your experience and what you learn, what you yeah. contributed? Yeah. So, uh, after two years of studying here, I, I got a chance to come here to this summer school for my first time. So, I'm glad to be here because um, I have this, again, this German culture uh, experience, exchange, and it's very nice. And not only a German culture experience, but we are all from different countries, so, and from different fields of study. So I have learned and gained a lot of experience from the social science and I'm coming from the food processing sector. So for me, it's very new, all about social science, about a public. Um, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Leave him alone. Have any Sri Lankan experience before? Any Sri Lankan? No, ah, okay. no, no. So you had a Sri Lankan experience? Also. Yeah, so my, the, my first expectation for, for this experience is to gain some uh, connections with right. other universities and other researchers like me and combine science experience to make uh, future proposals. For example, you are an expert in 3D printing, which is... Yeah, I wanted to actually ask about because my, a lot of my uh, viewers are also interested in 3D printing. So do you think uh, like uh, our 3D printing experience is, is useful for food uh, processing or food technology? Anything you think is, can be useful? I think so. And we will realize that 
better, in a better way, in the Anuga future, that we right. would right. see right. Uh, exactly what the system is all about. But for me, uh, I mean, many people have this uh, negative side view uh, right. with the 3D printing. I don't think this technology is for replacing all the food processing uh, strategies or technology, right. but it can be used to combine right. it. Combine. And yeah, yeah, it can be a part of the, of the whole system. Right. And I think it's very interesting. Thank you and for that. Uh, but, yeah. no, but I want to like ask next uh, about uh, your research interest, the project you have uh, presented, any uh, possibility for collaboration. So what, is, what are your interests for other people to work with? Yeah. Well, my, I presented two projects which are already uh, in two in one and a half year would be already finished, but it's in food waste and cassava leaves uh, processing. But for the future, I we also have another uh, kind of projects in, in ongoing projects like, for example, processing of different tropical fruits, but not all not only processing for the value in the whole food chain, mm. but also uh, food safety issues. Okay. We have a lot of food safety issues mm. in the tropical regions. Okay. So this is something I would like to work with uh, in combination with other universities. And, yeah. and also I want, uh, uh, since U.S. is island, uh, and also my country is also island, but we are very far away. So do you like to say something about the uh, Dominican Republic as a country, as a society? Well, Dominican Republic is well known for its tourism, right? We have really nice beaches. The sun is there the whole year round and we have everything. It's in a small country, but we can offer any kind of things. We have different kind of products, agricultural products. Uh, people are very nice, like me, very kind, you know. We can dance, but we work hard at the same time. And we can do really good, nice research. And yeah, we, we have everything. Okay. We can find it. Okay. Uh, finally, I want to ask you, um, uh, like, any, if you want to share any uh, news, message, invitation to my viewers, particularly the Sri Lankan <laughs> so people from I think about 20 countries in my YouTube channel. So, any final words from you? Yeah, what can I say? <laughs> well, uh, actually, I will talk about him. He, in the whole group, is, has been very active from the beginning, I would say. So, he has kept the group very active. He is always asking good questions and actually I will follow him. I, I haven't seen his videos but I guess because of his way of talking to people that he is very active. So I just will say keep following him and watching his videos because he is really nice and I will do it too. Yeah, thank you very much. It's been nice to have you as my subscriber. <laughs> <laughs> and thank you very much for all the best for your research, social and other okay? Adios. Adios. Bye. Bye. <laughs>